River State Governor Siminalai Fubara has declared that his administration will not surrender to bare-faced blackmail while committing to consolidating on the gains made in ensuring the peace, advancing good governance, delivering more critical projects and sustaining the increase in the internally generated revenue IGR of the state. The governor also commended President Bola Tinubu for his bold, dynamic and pragmatic economic reforms targeted at correcting the structural deformities in the past or of the past and ushering Nigeria into a new vista of sustainable economic growth and prosperity. Governor Fubara spoke during the 64th Nigerian Independence Day anniversary parade at the Government House Arcade in Port Harcourt. He urged Nigerians to be thankful that God has endowed them with everything required to build a great nation where no one should ever be oppressed and where all should live in peace and plenty. The mission of our founding fathers at independence was to build a united, secured nation anchored on the value of brotherhood, democracy, justice, and equality of all people, tribe, and nation. However, Nigeria is still total amidst diverse challenges, including widespread human insecurity. After 64 years of self-rule, indeed, the prevailing economic hardship has made life more difficult for most Nigerians. Governor Fubara assured that his administration will work assiduously to ensure the safety and security of lives and property while guaranteeing equal social and economic opportunities for all residents of River State. Despite the economic hardship and the social ill, the devil in our nation and striving its progress, we still have good reason to celebrate and be grateful to God as a nation and people. Let us also commit ourselves to work hard, to work hand in hand with the federal government to tackle the economic, social, and political challenges, including judicial terrorism, nepotism, corruption, and abuse of power that have diminished our democracy, saved our good, and caused untold hardship to our people. Our faith and strength are in God. We will enable us to continue to promote, protect, and defend the political and social economic interests of our dear state at all costs. I assure you that we will never surrender to bare-faced lies and blackmail from anyone, no matter how powerful he may be, but remain focused and rededicated to the interests of our nation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.